What is up guys, welcome back to my channel and welcome to a brand new video. Me and Sylvia have got Dudley Zoo entirely to ourselves by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah, it's like abandoned. It is like abandoned, look, we've got the chair lifts going up, all these rides are off. I'm off two days in the week, Sylvia's not. We don't get a lot of time to do these sorts of things, but Sylvia's put the day off work. We've come here on this perfect day. It is cold, raining, but nobody's here, which is the best thing. He's tall, isn't he? I know. He's got eyes like Tiki. They do. It is really, really we cold. Have red noses later. Red noses, snotty noses. There's going to be snot running down my face. Oh, that looks like a fun park. But I don't think that's for, for people. Oh, it's, <laughs> it's for monkeys. <laughs> <laughs> oh my days. Oh my God. Jesus Christ, that thing's huge. God. Mate, you're massive. That's what everybody says to me. These guys Hello. are huge. Hello. Look at this guy here. <laughs> 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 Dude, dude, hello. <laughs> How he looks at you. <laughs> he looks at me like, what's up? Can I have some? <laughs> There's one there. Do you know? <gasps> There's one. <laughs> Look how close the, the city is. Well, just behind me there, you've got this little town. And we're just in the zoo with all the zoo animals. Animal hospital. There's a little hospital down there for animals only. <laughs> You're a tiny little thing. So guys, we're just reading the sign about this, this structure. Hopefully the wind isn't too bad. But yeah, basically this was an old kiosk for refreshments back in the day. And they've kind of kept it here. It is a listed, listed structure now, grade two listed. I forget the name of the like design. I can't think where it's, where it's called. Hyperbolic kind of, maybe that's the right word. I'm not sure. It's got that kind of vibe to it. In fact, if you look at the park here, it's all got that kind of vibe to it, all the roundness. It's like a very late 70s, kind of early 80s vibe. It's good that it's still there and it's um, listed as well. Hopefully the wind isn't too bad through the mic. I forgot my tripod today as well. Well, I've got the tripod, I forgot the screw for it. I'm having to hold the GoPro just by holding it like this. Oh, leopards. Yeah, snow leopard heights. Snow leopard heights. Sylvia is literally, literally above your head. Yeah, yeah he's there. <laughs> I mean, hopefully we get to see some animals today. I mean, so far, most of them are indoors, but it is cold. Some animals are used to that, they don't care. Is that there? Uh, Wolverine, I think. Wolverine. Wolverine. Where's Sylvia going? Oh, she's Hello. There. Oh, you're cute. Sylvia. Oh. Oh. Hello, up here. Hello, friendies. He won't look up. He's like, where are they? I can hear people, but I can't see them. Ah, there we go. Hello. Oh, okay. So, he was just ignoring us. It wasn't that he didn't know where we were. He was just ignoring us. His name is Luna. Is yes, it really? Luna? I don't know. Oh. <laughs> um, that's what Luna does at home. Luna. Maybe his name Wolf. Wolfie. And his name Irene. Oh. That is such a cool way to get down. Oh, that's so cute. Mm. <laughs> oh, I'd love a pet one of these. <laughs> I wouldn't like that thing to attack me. Oh, Big scratch. There's nothing inside. Oh, <laughs> bloody cute you are. Mm. Where's he going now? Are you climb the tree. He's looking at the magpie. Oh God, he is, isn't he? Yeah. Magpie's playing with him. <laughs> Oh, you things are beautiful. That round building that's listed, all these kind of got the same vibe to them. I reckon it was built in maybe the 70s, the 80s. It's got that kind of old school vibe to it. Yeah. You've got people standing below, people standing up top on a busy day. There's even a platform for even higher. That's from the platform up there. This photo was taken from there. So we're currently here. And then people can obviously look, it looks like it used to be a polar bear in here at one time. Mm. That's cool, isn't it? Look how busy it is. 
take the camera with you. Boom! Anything here? Oh my god, I would be so scared here. Excuse me, guys. You come back over here. Please don't walk away. We'll be back to you in a minute. You stay there, okay? Hello, guys. Hello. Oh, don't walk away, beautiful boys and girls. Look how big those barn doors are. I know, I see them when we're walking down. Don't play with your ball. The giraffes are the first big animals that have been sort of lively. What's the biggest problem being a giraffe? I'd love to stroke you, I really would. I wouldn't care if you bit me, to be honest. What a beautiful looking creature. Yeah. Oh, he's digging. Oh, look at your nose. Oh, he's covering himself up with his tail. Oh my God. If that's not the cutest thing you've ever seen. Oh my God. Big tail. There we go. In fact, I could do the sailing. Isn't that nice. <laughs> so this is called an a goatee. It looks like a giant guinea pig. I reckon it, it could bite you. Yeah, I reckon it wouldn't be like that vicious. But guys, we have a two-toed sloth and we found him. He's lying up there. <laughs> How the hell has he balanced on that? <laughs> That's just an electric pipe <laughs> for the lighting and stuff. And he's got his arms stretched out. You can see his arm there. His two legs like opened up like a chicken. He's just chilling, isn't he? Making like a, a cat sound. Okay. Hello. Too close. When we were walking up earlier, I seen them looking over the window at us. Look at them. Mm. <laughs> they keep looking up, see what's if anyone's coming. Come to Rose, we're here. If you can hear, I don't know if you can hear them. They're making like cat meowing sounds, aren't they? Yeah. Like, Near them. Oh. <laughs> oh. Can you go? Talk tiki. Talk tiki. That sound. It gets so annoying at times. Yeah. And whenever he sees you, he always screams. Mm. You are his person. Imagine teaching them that and then coming back in like two years and them all doing the same noise. Cuddles. Cuddles. It's a bottle. Mm. What's this GoPro made of? It's plastic. Don't run away, King Julian. Yeah, is that yours? Is that your slot? Oh, you're just the cutest. Yeah. <laughs> so goddamn cute. Oh, you're just the cutest thing ever. These whiskers. Yeah. Oh no. Look at the bug. It's a big yellow bug. <laughs> and another one. And it's another a, one. It's a bug. <laughs> Shh, 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 
So a lot of this place is listed, like this enclosure for the seals or sea lions. It's um, going down there. It's actually the original castle moat, which I think is really cool. At one time they had dolphins here, it said. They also had a killer whale at one point, but the, the salt that they added to the water, it ended up deteriorating a lot of a lot of the sides. So it got fixed up and then it got made available back for the um, back for the sea lions again. But it's so interesting that a lot of the place is listed, like that 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 pool is listed, and then some of the other buildings that we saw. It's a, it's amazing. I, I really really like this zoo to be fair. Oh, don't be scared, boys. I'll come down to your level. Look at the camera. Yeah, you, know, you can't see yourself, can you? It's just a camera. Oh, now it's over there. <laughs> just a camera. Just a camera. You're so cute. You're so cute. Oh, where did you come from? You look like one now. <laughs> We've all that fair. <laughs> so cute. Oh, we have some ducks. <laughs> I can see some, yeah. I absolutely love penguins. I can remember when we did the penguin feed? So this is another of the listed buildings built in 1935 to 37. Again, grade two listed. It's like the fifth listed building we've seen so far here today. Of course, you've got the castle as well. There's all these old photos at the share and you see how it used to look. Look nice like that actually, all open. And you see all these glass windows, look nice, it's all open. Obviously now they've filled all that in and it's used for like says discovery center so they'll have like school trips and things like that but it's so interesting that they've kept it all as it was what you're looking at look at that up there what noise do penguins actually make <coughs> not that one. Oh, he's swimming i'm just feeling he's so swimming oh I'm swimming hi penguin these are about the size of the ones we fed aren't they some may be a little bit taller, some a bit smaller. Watch out um, for the leaves. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Just floating around. I know. Doing my thing. Uh, uh. That's a nice penguin, Mike. <laughs> At least we know now. <laughs> uh. So he's getting a chalky bar. Which one is it? Dairy milk. I'm just going to close her eyes and just pick it whichever one comes to her first. Don't be scared. You're a big boy, aren't you? Mm -hmm. Mm, you're a big boy. Any reptiles can you see? I can see spider webs there. Cobwebs. I don't like that. What are we looking for? Python. It says python. It could be anywhere, couldn't it? Python. Python, Python, Python. Oh my God, it's there. I'm joking. I was trying to make you jump. Oh my God. Boa constrictor. Look at him all tangled up. You see his head? Oh He's got his eyes open. Hello, my friend. There's a bug down here. <gasps> Your food's still alive. You're gonna get eaten, unfortunately, unless you hide. Go somewhere high and hide. Just letting you know, he's gonna go somewhere high and hide. It's all a part of the food chain, isn't it? A tree boa. Yeah, I was in tree boa constrictor. I can't see you, but he's under that, that there. Mm. I just did movement. This guy, is this guy? Hello, you okay? I don't like that scratching sound on the glass. It goes through me. Oh, he wants to come out. He can't come out, I'm afraid. He wants to come out, but he can't. He's banging on, he's banging on the glass. Oh my God, crocodile. Do you want to come and eat my fingers? I think we've got a bit of a staring competition going on here. He's just staring at me and I'm staring at him. Just look, look at here, over there. Look at that girl there. 
And then look at me. He's not moving at all. Maybe they crossed? No, I don't think they are. Mm -hmm. Look at this man. Mm. It's like Franklin when he's drag himself and you always see the lines from his tail. Looks like leather. Mm -hmm. No fast movements, not even for each other. Look at his things on his back, they're like blue. Mm -hmm. You haven't moved, have you, at all? He's a prop. <laughs> he's not a prop. Oh, you look like a big headed Franklin. Mm. <laughs> so we're just in the uh, wallaby. Wallaby walkthrough, something like that. Wallaby walkthrough. Yeah, there's loads of them. Hi guys. <laughs> so cute. God, I love animals so much. You nuzzling on some grass. <laughs> oh, I like the squirrel fear. Mm. Hello. You like a squirrel, kangaroo, and a bat all in one. We just found a couple of monkeys. All in the trees. I don't know if you can just see this one there somewhere. Somewhere over there there's one. I can't really see through the screen very well. Oh look, 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 look. <laughs> so cute. <laughs> oh wow. But the one that's um, sitting close to us in the tree. I didn't have my camera out at the time and I said by the time I get my camera out it's going to be finished but you can see the little sort of ropey bit coming down and he swung around this tree, got onto that and then walked across it. It looks so clever. Do an impression of how he walked. He's walking like, the thing is he had his uh, yeah, he's out That's as it, well. Yeah, he's bouncing with his arms on. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, you're going to the top one? Come on. What can you show us? Where are you going? <laughs> Go on, do a big poo. No. <laughs> Look at his face. He's looking with the watching you. Come on, where are you going? Oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh my. Just like that, just like that, just like that. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Oh, wait, wait, wait. How are you gonna make it? Oh, they're so clever, aren't they? Come on, what are you gonna do? <laughs> Whoa, he dropped down. Oh my god. <laughs> Well done! <laughs> that was amazing. Glad I caught that on video. <laughs> Wonder if this place is haunted. It's got to be, hasn't it? According to the sign down below, there was a Dorothy Beaumont who died here in the siege of 16... 1614, something like this. She died here as they reckon that she haunts this castle. You can see her at night. So you see here, uh, Birmingham in the far distance there. Two of the big skyscrapers. These stairs feel like they're on back the wrong way, like. I know. They're in that way. So normally they go that way. Yeah, I know what you mean. The reason for. Back in like the medieval times, you'd have, like most people are right handed, shield, sword, and you can come down, hold on, and you can swing around the corner. So you want to be in that way, don't you? And your shield by the wall to guard yourself. People coming up the castle stairs, if they're going that way, which is the opposite way, they can't swing properly because they're going around if that makes sense mm -hmm. they can't really guard themselves so that them stairs seem like they're on the wrong way around <laughs> food there's some food above your head so i've been showing you throughout the day these these old structures from like the past um history of the zoo now uh, we've just had a little walk around that platform up there behind me. It's got that really old fashioned kind of, it's kind of got a Soviet vibe to it, like very, um, very brutalist. But then we went right up the top and we walked around it. Very interesting structure. This actually would be a pool here. So this was for bears originally. Obviously got that platform. Imagine that on a busy day, full of people. Look at the health and safety, like there's just like one little barrier. Nothing stopping you from going over the edge. Whereas now they put all these fences up, electric wiring, and all sorts to keep people out. And that's the difference in today from like past and you know, even up to like the 70s and 80s, how different things have to be these days. And we're so interested in seeing the animals, but at the same time, I love seeing all these old structures because you can tell that 
they've really maintained and looked after what they've got here. Hey, he's having a little drink and a lie down. Come in, us. Hello. Hello, friends. Please don't bang on the window. You'll scare me and I'll drop my camera. We don't get many visitors on these kind of days, so hi. We were just seeing these little structures here dug into the ground and it's saying excavation work in Stull's Cavern began in 1800 and the void created was used as an underground storage area during World War II. Once human disturbance stopped, it became home for nocturnal life. So they put recording equipment in there and there's all, all different species of bats down there. My humps, my hump, my hump, my humps. My lovely camel humps. Okay guys, so I'm gonna go ahead and end this video here. Thank you very much for watching and thanks for joining us at Dudley Zoo. Don't forget, drop a like down below, subscribe if you are new and hopefully I will see you in the next video.